All right, John, we have a vacant spot on the end of the line here that I should like to have you fill immediately. All right, Bob, let's fill it with Wanda Shoemaker. Come on down. You're the next contestant on the prize. He's right. Wanda, I welcome you to contestants row. May I point out the next item up for bids in the price is right? A new aquarium. This black lucite aquarium with mirrored band has one round window in front, two oblong windows on the sides, and it comes on a small pedestal. Wanda, what do you bid on the aquarium? $375. $375. And now Lisa says. $400. $400 to you, Chester. $285. $285. And Catherine winds it up with. $450. $450. The actual retail price of the aquarium is $625. And the aquarium goes to Catherine. Catherine. Yes. Weren't you one of the first four contestants? Yes. I thought it's so. About time. It is about time, Catherine. Now, I'd like to give you this a new camping trailer. The Sun Valley by Coleman, the 19 foot camper, is equipped with three burner range, dinette, and sleep six comfortably, can be towed by most medium cars. It's a prize worth. $4,395. Now, Catherine, you may win that camper in the cliffhangers game, and you may win, may win three more prizes. What are they, John? Well, Bob, first, nylon steel toys. Since 1946, built to last. Lots of play value for boys and girls, made with care to give with love. Nylons. Second, Windmere Gentle Curls 24 Instant Hair Setter with ultra smooth cushioned rollers for firm, long lasting curls without tangles from Windmere. Third, a spice rack from McCormick Schilling, who brings you the finest in spices and seasoning mixes for conventional and microwave ovens, your house of flavor, McCormick Schilling. Now, Catherine, I am going to ask you the price of that toy. What's the price of that truck? Fifth, $20. $20, is that right? No, now that mountain climber will move one step for every dollar you missed the price of that truck. He moved one dollar. How much is the toy? Eighteen dollars, that's very good. Now wait, what are you, oh, 18 moved too, yeah. Gina Edwards, who has a, an IQ of 160, is in control of that, and she had a little trouble subtracting <laughs> 18 from 20. Isn't that who's back there, isn't that Gina? Gina, yes, come out here, let them, here she is, see, she's in charge. Now, it, it's... Uh, I did it right. You I did, did it right? I did it right. You didn't do it right. The mountain climber only moved one step. I thought I did it right. <laughs> yes. i get back there. We'll check your IQ again. I can't believe it anyway. Now, Catherine, how much is that hair setter? 35. 32. She says $32. Is she right? No. Now watch the mountain climber. He'll start and stop a lot because Gina's not having one of her best days. Up to seven, eight... You know if he goes off the cliff at the top of the mountain that you lose the game. Ten now, okay. How much is the hair setter? Forty dollars. Now, he's on ten. He can go fifteen steps safely. How much is the spice rack? Don't miss it by more than fifteen dollars one way or the other. Fifty-five. Fifty-five dollars. Is that right? No. Now, let's hope you have not missed it by more than fifteen dollars. He's up to fourteen and I'm not even worried yet. We're not, yes, he's, you're a winner. He stopped on 15. Look at that, $50, you missed it for only $5. You win, congratulations, yes. And we're ready for showcase showdown number two after this message. 